From early 2020, our team has been investigating first COVID in January in China and in East Asia, tracking this across Europe and North America, as well as Australia and New Zealand. And finally, as the pandemic moves into developing countries, looking at the impact in developing countries in Latin America, Sub-Saharan Africa, and South Asia. The important thing to know about this outbreak is that there's no right or wrong approach from the start. This is all coming out in real time and countries can just make the best decisions they can given an uncertain evidence base. The work our team is doing is looking at the policies being implemented and how the global community can support. So for example, how are countries approaching how to exit lockdown? How are they approaching school reopenings? What are the decisions being made around stopping hospital infections or nosocomial infections? We produce this research quite rapidly given the urgency of the situation and then share this with governments as well as on our website and with the general scientific community so that others can learn from this analysis and to help other teams develop their research and their work. Our team has been working quickly. We've basically working across the hours, collecting primary data um, on policies, trying to look at any preprint studies that are relevant, assessing their quality, and trying to put these into briefs that can be quickly turned around to influence um, whether it's you know public opinion or whether it is government officials or whether it's the scientific community as well, trying to point to data gaps where we actually need more research and actually pushing for monitoring in different countries as experiments take place in real time.